I'm guessing you live again. I'm live again. You uh, you literally started the live off by saying, I guess you're live again. I just started it. Yeah. So, yeah. Anyways, um, welcome to TikTok Vules. Yes, you're right. I did a little live stream on YouTube and let everyone know that we were going to be going on here next. Would you like to say hi? Hi. <laughs> Am I on YouTube? Yes. Well, this is TikTok, but uh, yeah, you will be on YouTube uh, after the stream. Um, so yeah, we got a lot of people here that like the clocks. I'm just waiting for a gigantic ramp clock. Are y'all going to upload the, the TikTok live archive of the clocks at noon? Yes, exactly. You okay. know, you already knew. Pull that one for me. <laughs> Bless you. Sign of the times. Sign of the times. I like that. I wish the, the um the sign of time um um I, I wish that there's a, there's a no um one of these installed. Oh yeah, there is one back there, but it uh doesn't keep time. It needs a new movement. This one works, but it's sold. It's just on display here at the moment. But uh, everyone in here, uh, stay in for another couple minutes. I promise you, you're not gonna regret it because we got about a thousand clocks about to chime the hour here. And they're all getting ready to start just now. I'm just waiting. I'm that just bell. Waiting. Curbo. Waiting. He wants to see that one chime. Kerbo, Caleb, what's going on? Caleb, you're about to hear uh, a couple hundred grandfather clocks here go off. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be very interesting. I got a couple of my friends here with me. What was the name of the one with the old school music box disc? That is the Belfry Tower phonograph over here. Um, it is 4MH715. Um, they got it here at Champs. It is $2.99, uh, but it's new old stock. It's even got the original sticker on it from the 90s. Um, we're going to do a little uh, just walk around here. It's getting ready to start. <laughs> yeah. New location found Champs Clock Shop, Douglasville, Georgia. Get here before five. We're open till five.
Yeah, I missed it. <laughs> I was standing here waiting on it. <laughs> oh, man. I should have been standing there waiting, too. Oh, again. <laughs> <laughs> man, that is overstimulation on max power. <laughs> yeah, I'd say. <laughs> Do the gritty? I don't know how to do the gritty or else I totally would. Where's the chicken clock? You should have snuck him in. Yeah, I really should have snuck the chicken clock in. That would have been perfect. You know, it totally slipped my mind. I didn't even think about bringing it. I, that would have been a genius idea. Man, how could I have forgotten the chicken clock? How could I? How could I have forgotten the chicken clock? <laughs> oh, terrorizing children. Fun. <laughs> uh, okay, so somebody asked me, let me switch this off. Somebody asked me, uh, where is this shop located? This is, uh, hold on, overstimulation. Okay, there. Uh, this shop is located in Douglasville, Georgia. Champ's Clock Shop, the greatest clock shop to all mankind, and that is the truth. Uh, fun fact, if you didn't know, I have been here in Douglasville for two weeks, just about two weeks now. Uh, working on setting all these clocks uh, The quartz ones are sort of my specialty if you follow you know that I have a lot of uh, the musical rhythm clocks um, and uh, I went through and set Every single battery operated clock that chimes in here check the batteries in them um, all that good stuff um, It's been great meet and greet at the clock shop. I know right I had I actually had a couple people uh come to meet me which i thought was pretty neat um it, it's sort of humbling the way i take a road trip let me know kerbo if you're coming i'll be on my way for sure i'm on the next flight um but yeah if you uh if you're looking for something to do for sure next march uh march 8th saturday march 8th next year uh so yeah we got this one over here do you have grandfather clock parts yes uh we repair grandfather clocks here so yeah do you guys want to introduce yourselves to everyone I'm Drake from from YouTube channel clock 1010 on YouTube yeah yeah and you I am a 11 year old <laughs> clock collector that wants to do YouTube but no one lets me <laughs> hey it's fine I wasn't allowed whenever I was your age either do you have a name <laughs> my name is Chris well, it is very nice to meet you, Chris. Everyone is glad to have you here. <laughs> Lots of clock lovers in here. I really wish we could hear that one up there too. That one up there? Well, here, hold my phone. Yep, okay. This one? Yep. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Rate those chimes out of 10, what do you think? 10. 10? I like those chimes too, those are pretty good. This actually looks similar to, to the George, uh, the case actually looks similar to the George um, Walkwalk. I'd have to see that one to know what you're talking about. <laughs> that would be, uh, a treat. Let's see. Where are you located at? This is Douglasville, Georgia, about a half hour from Atlanta. So uh, come see us anytime. Today was the day to come for sure. I mean, hey, if you're in the area, come through before five. Uh, these people want to see the cuckoo clock. You guys want to come see the cuckoo clock? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. We're going to walk over here. Whenever you want, it don't matter. Okay. Okay, we got my mom here. Who's so that'll gonna... be the shaky camera now. Yeah, she's going to be uh, <laughs> filming for us now. You right. can also try out a sport called Rhythm Madness. A, a sport that you can just click a bunch of buttons on a bunch of rhythm clocks like this. Where's the million dollar cuckoo clock? Yes, and... that's where <laughs> okay. we're getting to that right now. And Vegas Baby Girl says, where are you located? I we are... Oh, you did? Okay. We are at Chance Clock Shop in Douglasville, Georgia. And this is the world's largest cuckoo clock here. Uh, and yeah, everyone's going to be like, yeah, but I heard this one is the world's largest cuckoo clock. Yeah, but you didn't. No, this is the world's largest cuckoo clock because it was made in Germany. This was made in Germany in the 80s. Fully mechanical movement works. It's working right now. You can come see it go off if you want. Um, but it's ahead. also known as the world's largest wheel cuckoo clock. Exactly. Palm Springs Charlie wants to know how long is it going to take to move the time tonight? I don't want to know. <laughs> listen, listen, Charlie, I got how many to weeks tell you. have you been here? I've been here for almost two weeks, um, and I got something to tell you. Uh, I started off setting all these clocks and. I was setting them an hour ahead because I'm thinking, okay, yeah, we got the chiming event, but then like after that, the hour is going to go ahead. So I'm going to set them all like an hour ahead and get ahead. And, um, Andy, one of the guys that works here, he said, um, what's going to happen at one o'clock or what's going to happen noon. at noon whenever they go off once they chime once instead of 12 times, you know, the grandfather clocks chime on the hour and what happens whenever everyone's here at 12 o'clock to hear them all chime 12 times and they all chime once so <laughs> i had to go back through and i was already about like 75 percent of the way done as well so then i had to go through and redo that but at least i had already checked the batteries and all of them so it sort of worked out that way i'm gonna go over here so they can see the world's largest wall hanging cuckoo oh, yeah, yeah. clock <laughs> It's so massive, but it's got a, ma a really small pendulum. Yes, and it has its own room. <laughs> and this one, and this one behind you was, this one behind you was formerly the, the world's largest coup clock um, back in the eighties. And, and it is losing so much time. <laughs> yeah. What about Brian that? Brian Austin asked if this is for right. sale. I do not believe it is for sale, but it, you could always call and find out. <laughs> it's definitely not for sale unless uh, <laughs> if someone makes um, the, the new Waters Waters Wheel Coo Clock. Was that whatever the world And wow, where is this? We are at and, Champs um, Clock the, Shop this not, in uh, Douglasville, this Georgia. Kind of near Atlanta. And Chevy is helping some customers. So I'm just going to walk around and let you see. It's not a clock, it's just a vibration. 
Yeah, I don't know. I think there's like a magnet or something there. Oh, that's moving around. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. It's, it's neat, though. I just put you back with my hair. Oh, my God. How did that work? I mean, like, she got me from practice. Oh my like, gosh. Oh, yeah. that is really so I was like, that's ballerina clock. I'm thinking, I didn't think it was a ballerina clock. Oh, no. 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 Interesting. Right. Cool. Why do you like to do work with Madness so much? <laughs> um, it's because of, yeah. of one of the people that that died recently. Um, I think he got. He also did, and I, and I wanted to, to join in with the little Madness. Oh, it's just weird because the each song. I think it's a Madness. Chevy is helping some customers, so I will ask him your questions when he gets done. <laughs> I know Suzanne212 has a good question, and Just Patrick has a good question. Speak up alarm clocks. You can show uh Where's a madness? Try it while you're here. <laughs> yeah. Boom <Little> madness. <laughs> Are there any super detailed clocks that track lunar that? cycles and other planets? I know some of the grandfather uh, clocks do the, the lunar one. cycles. You'll see that up at the top on some of them. next to it? Yeah, right? We have a couple. Yeah. Let me know if y'all need anything else. Thank you so much. Only works condition. Oh, it looks only the clock works, so it's sort of like that. The train doesn't go around. Yeah, the train. Yeah. Which I mean, they might be able to do something here. With it. Do they work on watches here? No, no, no watches here. Okay. Uh, similar, uh, similar. Types of things, but they don't work on watches. Here. No, just Patrick. They do not work on watches. And sorry, I had to talk to a customer for yes, a second. Yes, I know. Someone asked, "Are there any super detailed clocks that track lunar cycles and/or other planets?" Um, not here. I do know one. Do some of the grandfather that, clocks do the lunar? This one over here does. Um, <clears throat> Earth, and sun, and moon. Earth, sun, right and here. moon. Um, and it tracks, I mean, all the different, like, okay. star signs and stuff like that. And Palm Springs Charlie wants to know, what is the oldest clock here? Uh, 1700s, and it's upstairs. Upstairs? Uh, yeah, that's part of their personal collection. 1700s what? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you make some of these? Yeah, 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 yeah. Which one do you want to do? This one. That one right here? Yeah. Oh, that's cute. We'll do that every hour and a half hour. Really? Okay. All of them do that every half hour. There, there's some, I don't know, I don't know if these clocks are here, but we have to do No, yeah, these are Can you also do... Oh, that's a cute Oh, that is. 
The small one with the heart that he had on the... This one? Yeah, Atlanta Live, yeah. This, or what was it? Good Day Atlanta show. Because I like, watch the watch the chimney on that one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> and then this, this is the, we like to call it the hoo clock. Because, see all the owls? Mm -hmm. And... A little bit different than your average food. It's the owl one. I've seen it on Facebook. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that thing's neat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Somebody wants to know if you can show Was that the, the owl clock right this way? Yeah, yeah. You want to hear it again? Yeah. What were you going to say? <laughs> <laughs> Can you show the clock again with the star signs? Yeah, yeah. I can show you a different one actually that I think is better. Well, I don't know, it, it's not quite as cool. I'll Juicy, show you both, how about Juicy that? Juicy Kirby Legs is asking, where is this place, OMG? Would you like to tell them? Hi, Juicy Kirby Legs, <laughs> welcome. Uh, they, are, uh, they are regular here in the, in the live stream. Uh, <laughs> Juicy Kirby Legs, this is a uh, Champs Clock Shop in Douglasville, Georgia. Um, and I've been here for almost two weeks now working on getting all these clocks set and stuff. Um, but let me show you here. This is one that's different than the last one I showed you. If you want to see the other one, I'll go back to it. But this one has some star signs and stuff in it. Let me take the phone just for one yeah, second. This is a uh, Champs Clock Shop, and the model of this clock is the Rhythm Sign of the Times, um, 4MH744. Uh, it's pretty hard to find, and this is actually the last working one that we have here at the moment, um, and it's sold. <laughs> uh, but uh, that's not to say that there won't be any in the future. Uh, but yeah, it's a it's a pretty neat one. Um, and juicy Kirby legs, we would love to see you here. Let me know when you're coming and I will I will try and come if you can ever make it down. I would love to get to see you. Someone asked if the shop has a website or if it's in person only. Uh, they have a website, but uh, it's mainly in person only. They have like an eBay where they have a handful of things listed on there. Um, for example, there's this really cool uh, clock over here that I'm a big fan of. What is this? Some of you might know. You might. Oh, <laughs> not again! <laughs> yeah. Where's your gear? Where's your costume? It, <laughs> you want the costume? Yes, we want the costume. <laughs> Who wants to see the costume? <laughs> Juicy Kirby Legs says, yeah. Do you have a fancy Felix Cat Clock? Can you say the name of the Music Box Clock? Music Box Disc One again. I'm trying to track oh, it down. Really? That is the Belfry B E L F R Y T 
Belfry Tower Phonograph. Belfry uh, Tower Phonograph. Yes, but it might be easier if you just look up the model number 4M H715. <laughs> For my coattails. <laughs> 715. You ought to wear it like a Dutch chin. <laughs> All right, you had me do that the other Do they time. have a floral fantasy? There is no floral fantasy There's here. one real close to it. There is. <laughs> Let's go towards the floral fantasy. <laughs> oh, the chicken dance at Champ's Clock Shop. <laughs> There's the chicken dance, and then there's the champs chicken clock dance. <laughs> you are witnessing two guys who have been going on very little sleep. <laughs> that's, what, that's what happens when you sold 160 of these things. Yeah, right. Yeah. Now, that's as close to the floral fantasy as you're going to get. But uh, in, in here right now, anyway. This is Chevy's personal clock. But I wish they made more of those. I would own one of those myself. Mm -hmm. Where that one come from? Japan. Mm -hmm. Japan. And uh, what's the name of that telescope? Oh, God. <laughs> Don't do me like that again. Yeah. All right, what's the new telescope that's up in space that's bringing, sending all those cool images oh, back? No, it's, well, it's the new one. The new one. one. Linda yeah. would know. Where's Linda? Yeah. We need her. And I know it too. The Hughes, John Hughes, or the... Je Somebody in chat. Does right anybody now. know what the new telescope is in space? If yeah. so, please put it on mm -hmm. here. Yeah. <laughs> Sa yeah. Save these two, yeah. please. Yeah. We, the last time, these things <laughs> suck your brain out a little bit. <laughs> so you, the things that you could think of just James freely... Webb. You know, some of that is sucked into here. So <laughs> it's just like a sponge yeah. that sucks your brain away. Yeah. You know? James Webb. J yeah, the yeah. Webb. James uh, Webb, Mr. Webb right? Okay, we have someone here. We have someone here live who just said it, but then also so, Mr. David J said James so Webb. Thank you, Mr. Mr. David J. It takes the Webb telescope Earthling, I will ask to him. see these actual constellations. We have a question. Is there an Eli Bentley grandfather clock in your store? Uh, Eli Bentley? Yes. Eli Terry? I don't know of a Bentley, Eli Bentley. If, you, if you've seen it, uh, you can... I don't know where you would have seen it. Okay. Eli Bentley. Eli Bentley. This guy would know. Yeah. It doesn't ring a bell, but I mean, it sounds like an old... 17, 1800s tall case clock or something. Okay. But, uh. You know what does ring a bell, though? Yeah, maybe. Jeff Champion. <laughs> oh, he does ring yeah, a bell. Can ring a bell. Where'd you get this? Oh, I got it back there. Oh, you yeah. know, yeah. Yeah. Well, you gotta put them back in the same nest they come out. <laughs> Otherwise, they come and get you in the middle of the night and say, hey. <laughs> I only need your own um, Here is the large Felix clock. It's actually, they call it a Kit Kat clock. He's got all different colors too. You can see there's boys with bow ties and girls with eyelashes and necklace on. Wow. You're welcome, Earthling. Yeah. What is the blue clock called? That is, uh, it's easier for me to just tell you the model number because the name is in Japanese. The model number is 4MH663RA. That was from Jess Patrick. Jess Patrick. Good the, luck finding it because it was only in Japan. And you're welcome, Earthling. <laughs> said thank you for asking. About I'll take the this back for a minute. <laughs> Thank all y'all for coming in today. I hope that you're enjoying. Uh, my mom is the little video recorder, if you didn't see that That's today. So they, uh, <laughs> Thanks for bearing with me, guys. It's been pretty busy here today. Sorry I didn't get to go live for very long earlier, but that live stream that I did earlier at noon where we had the most chimes will be uploaded on my YouTube later. Uh, so go subscribe to Timeless Moments on YouTube if you would like to 
watch that. Drake here also did a live stream on his channel that is Clock 1010. Uh, but yeah, go go check it out. And uh, this is a future YouTube clock guy. We're going to play Minecraft sometime. Minecraft! <laughs> oh. Yeah, I know. I was doing this earlier. Can I see that real quick? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Juicy Kirby Leg says hi, Clock Mom. Hi, Clock Mom. Hi, Juicy Kirby Legs. So Jeff's busy right now. Um, oh yes, she has clock legs. See, she's got clocks on her leggings today. And oh, and and Kit Kat clock socks. You didn't need to take your shoes off. And <laughs> yes, you can. Just do the big one. <laughs> but, but I have a uh, question. Yes. So people keep saying there is a story behind this gigantic grandfather. Yeah. What is it? Well, you can ask Jeff. He'll he'll explain it better than I will. <laughs> that belonged to the family member of someone in history that was not very nice. <laughs> that lived in Germany. In the 1940s. <laughs> it's already expensive enough to bring in... You don't know history yet, so you don't know exactly who I'm talking about, but... <laughs> yeah. Uh, don't follow in his footsteps. That's all I got to say. <laughs> you guys want to see some of these over here? This is my favorite one right here. <laughs> it wasn't his clock, but it was his uncles or cousins. I'm not 100% sure. Like a distant family member, sort of. Uh, Jeff's talking with some customers, but we'll get the full story on that clock in a second. <laughs> whole farm of clocks. It is a whole farm of clocks. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, the Owlis. I I agree. <laughs> um, do you guys want to do your little rhythm madness thing again? Oh cool. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. They really like doing this. Feel free to try the sport when you get here. Yes. <laughs> Clock. How do you make this one? Oh, uh, it's on the other side. It says monitor. It's the, yeah, there you go. I think it's going already, actually. Totoro, we can get back to the Totoro clock in a second. Isn't it crazy this was probably one of the first try or time crackers ever made? Yeah. The oldest clock in there. Uh, 1700s and it's uh, it's upstairs. Uh, the one that I was on that is the uh, Time Cracker 2000, which is very similar to the Rhythm Peaceful Cosmos clock. These are all Tri Cracker clocks right here.
I love this one. Are these easy to repair? Not quite. <laughs> Not quite. If y'all came to the shop today, you could have got the chiming event special. Is this one? And then there's this one. It definitely would be a fun place, <laughs> for sure. If Evan sells um, his fault again, I, I, I'm definitely about buying it. Yeah. I, I almost um, bought his, but, but it, it ended. Yeah. I know, and he wasn't asking very much for it either. I thought it was a really, really good deal. I told him he should have put it for more. How's everybody doing today? Um, I want to buy another one. Um, I have one that stopped working properly. I love it so much. I'm in California. Um, depending on what's wrong with it, you may be able to get it shipped here. Um, but uh, that would probably cost a hell of a lot in shipping, and it might be worth it just to try and find someone that's near you that fixes them. Um, this is Douglasville, Georgia. Uh, about a half hour from um, uh, Atlanta. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, let's see. They have plenty here, though, for sure. And if there's any you're interested in, uh, call us, send an email, find us on Facebook, send a message. That is uh, Champ's Clock Shop, once again. I got to take the chicken stuff off. I'm getting hot. <laughs> Anybody else want to try it on? I want to. You I want to? Uh, this is the same stuff I wore in the uh, the little commercial thing I did. Wait, what? You did a commercial? Yeah, for those chicken clocks whenever they came out. <laughs> what was that? Let's see. In your opinion, what company made the best quality grandfather clocks and what country made them? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Where's your dad at? You gotta get your dad to take a picture. <laughs> I wanna dance on that. Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd say Hershey, probably, by the way. <laughs> Here, come over here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Awesome, <man>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's loving it. He's lying. Come and dance with me. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Are you nice? Hey, baby, <laughs> wake up. Are you nice? Come and dance with me. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna go viral, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get your picture with your dad, so I yeah. can get your picture with That's your dad. Cool, buddy. Yeah. Do you want your picture with your dad? Yeah. 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 <laughs> hey, hold it for you. Hey, Good dad, wake up. Hershey nine tubes sell for big money. Right. If you like Hershey, I got something to yeah. show you here in a second. You're looking good, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Can, can I? See? Can I get? Can, can, I get <laughs> can I get my picture with him? Yeah. Too? yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. You're just well. I'm on the live stream, okay. so you have to do it on your camera. Yep. Dad, he hold this for a second. Can you get a haircut, huh? Yeah? Okay. yeah, it's too short. All right. Oh wait, we gotta get the chicken. Get the chicken. Oh, I don't know how to do this. Live stream. Live stream. Hello. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you get did you get like uh I have no their contact information and I'm, stuff so we can yeah, get together at some point? Yeah. Yeah, because we'll be down there. Hey Bryden, how's how's it going? 
Here, hold on. I'm going to come in here. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. If I'm ever in Minnesota, I will for sure make my way there. I actually have heard of that before. Um, I'm from Ohio, actually. So, um, but if you like Hershey, check this out. This was the very last Hershey clock ever produced right here, over here in the corner. Um, it's my family's business. That's pretty neat. Um, you'll, uh, you know, I think I've had someone in here, uh, like in my live stream, like talking about your shop at some point. Um, but yeah, I'm into clocks, any sales, plenty of sales. Um, especially today. Um, it's been very hectic today. We had some specials going on a couple of clocks. Um, but yeah, it's been a lot of fun. This is uh, the last fully American made grandfather clock. Everything from the case to the face, all hand, um, what do you call it? Drawing a blank. <laughs> Brain fart. Yeah. What's the price? Yeah, that's, that's the kicker right there. That's probably one of the most expensive, if not the most expensive in the store <laughs> um yeah but every single aspect of this clock is american made and it still works it's just amazing um but yeah what does it sound like yeah <laughs> that one i don't want to touch did you see how much it was 125 grand yeah <laughs> you could own a house uh you could own a, a house uh. literally you could get like a a decent house, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, yeah. There's the big cuckoo clock over there. Which clock would you live if you had the chance? Uh, I like this one a lot. I, I don't, like how this one has like the big second hand. You don't juicy Kirby legs, right? what do you mean? Yes, I like that too. I took a video of this one last year just because I love that second hand so much. How rare is it to find one for second hand? Pretty rare. I mean, if you look at all the ones that they have here in the store, there aren't many with a second hand. You know that's what I mean? Like one that. I even saw for exactly. Yeah. I mean, I mean that it, that's an exception, some, but yeah, some have the second hand dial, but literally live clock, in my bad type two fast. Clock, clock in here besides like that one has like one of those on it. Yeah. Like this one. I think uh, juicy Kirby legs. I'd probably pick this one. Because it's big. You know, I got a lot of room. Uh, which clock would you guys live in? If you had to pick a clock to live in, which one would it be? I just live in the Gazo. Yeah, yeah, I love the Gazo. That's a good choice, too. I, I think either the, the Gazo 11 tube or the uh, Aku clock right there because it has a, a really nice music box. Oh yeah, I like the music box on that too, yeah. If you got a type of thing, you fall off the wall, break the cuckoo clock, break the clock under, and break your legs. <laughs> uh, Tiki, if you go to timelessclocks.co, I'm going to do a little, I'm going to respond to your comment here and type this so you know. Timelessclocks.co. Um, I have um, a bunch of rock and roll chickens for sale. Um, so if you're interested in finding one and getting one again, they are $89.99 free shipping. Um, and uh, they just remade them. Um, I don't know if you knew they remade them last year um, <laughs> for the first time since the 90s. I think. Uh, no, I didn't. But uh, yeah, promo time. You know it. You know it. I had I had to. We're gonna go look at the tower clock. You guys wanna come see yes, the tower sir. clock from the outside coming. and then we'll go upstairs? Yep. Hi, puppy. Baby, like, what are you talking about? Buns. Baby, baby, like, oh. Oh, okay. I was confused there for a second. I bought it in the 90s. I wish that I was alive back then to see them in their prime, you know, because I love that one so much. Yeah, the last time I was here, I got to hear a strike from outside. Oh, yeah. 
Wait, I, there's a way to like make it chime without it being the hour. Yeah. On the inside of the clock. <laughs> One of these days you'll go too far and Big Ben will be in your yard. <laughs> Imagine if they had Big Ben here. That'd be yeah. <laughs> that'd be it's something. Probably it's probably gonna fall in a hundred years because every year it starts tipping ever so slightly. I feel like I read about that at some point. But yeah, that is the tower clock. So whenever you're driving on the road out here in the middle of nowhere, you see this big clock tower, you know you're at the right place. <laughs> um welcome back lobster welcome back um i think someone had given me a rose earlier and i didn't say anything and i feel really bad about that i don't know what was going on at that point in time but thank you so much for that i really appreciate it we got the boys over here taking a, taking a break chilling out that's what i need too what's up you want a bag of chips uh Maybe after I'm done, I'll take a bag. Yeah, yeah come on. Somebody come with me. Ask if I cleared out the food. I might have to grab me a cookie. Um, soon, which live are you doing? Uh, I am live right now. Uh, I want chips. Okay. Uh, Juicy, just send me your address and I'll send you a bag of chips. Uh, just let me know what kind you want. Um... How much are some of the Kit Kat clocks? Like the red one or the black and red? Black and red is 70 and the red is also 70. Um, so check them out. Uh, check them out for sure. Uh, you can get them in here, uh, but also uh, online, other places. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> Where is this? A dollar for chips? We had free food today. Y'all missed out. You should have been here. We had that whole table out there full of food. Free food. We got cookies. Oh, he got cookies. <laughs> Where is this? How much are the chips? The chips are free. Free food today. It's the Champs Clock Shop Chiming event. Uh, only today, though. If you come to Champs any other day, they, they probably won't have uh, free chips or free food or anything like that. <laughs> The chiming event is today until five. So we got about an hour left. That's Andy. What's up, Andy? Thank you, Purple, for the heart puff. I hope I said that right. I'd like to see the 12 o'clock time. Uh, that will be on my YouTube. I was live on here earlier. Drake was also live, I believe. And uh, we, uh, we got... All the clocks going off at 12. It was crazy. There were so many people in the shop. You couldn't hardly walk around. Um, but yeah, check out my YouTube, Timeless Moments. If you would like to see the 12 o'clock hour chiming, there will be that live stream coming pretty soon. I'm hoping later on today. Chicken clock, someone wanted. <laughs> you gotta love it you gotta love it come on <laughs> if you say you don't like it you're lying <laughs> uh he accepted his fate this guy said you accepted your fate <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh my gosh uh holy cow i didn't think i needed a clock but geez i would love to have a few of these they have a bunch of really nice ones here this is probably top three favorite grandfather clocks for me in here drake might judge me for that a little bit but I love this one right here. It's amazing. Um, is that a Hammer Urban? Was that clock holding wine? Yeah, this is Urban 2, I believe. Either Urban 2 or Urban 3. I'm not the best at Howard Miller clocks. That's sort of Evan's thing. Mine's Rhythm Clocks, Evan's Howard Miller. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, 
Yes, this is holding wine. <laughs> it's got a whole wine rack and you can put your glasses up there too. It's kind of neat. This is Champ's Clock Shop, by the way. Flojo. Um, but yeah, what clock did you play before the chicken? Uh, that was the Small World Ceremony Clock. I can go over here and play it again. It's pretty hard to find, but the model number is 4MH647. Um, find CTS clocks. I'll play one of these two afterwards for you. I'll do it. Okay, we'll do that first. Afterwards for you. I'll do it. Okay, we'll do that first. Yeah, you could do you could do one for sure. This one's about to go up too. Oh yeah. Here's the ceremony again, real quick. Oh, I gotcha. Little dudes going up and down. It's going. Yeah. That one good. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> and there goes that one. Um, let's see here. What else can I play? See this one over here. Who makes the ceremony clock? That is rhythm. Um, uh, all of the musical clocks in here are made by rhythm. Uh, there are some other brands. Seiko is another major brand, but all the ones in this shop are rhythm. Oops. Yeah, I will in a second. Clock bird, please. Do you want a cuckoo clock? <laughs> Is that what you're asking? Uh, a time cracker. I can definitely do a time cracker. Um, and yeah, their website is a little confusing. They don't have anything for sale. Like they don't have a thing set up where you can buy them on their website. You have to call or email or come in person. So that's kind of a, that's kind of a little bit of an issue <laughs> for some people. And here at the store, they don't even take credit card. They take cash or check. <laughs> uh, so yeah but uh oh thank you lens for the heart puff we're gonna do this uh time cracker here and then i'll go back and do some cuckoos oops i hit the wrong button <laughs> i hit the display button instead of the demo button here i'm gonna get it out of display mode first here some of these look like they might curse you or be haunted and I'm here for it. <laughs> yeah, definitely for sure. This could be one. There we go. Do they want like a mechanical or battery operated? Um, we'll go back there and see. You said this was a prototype. This is a prototype. Yeah, if you look at it. Oh, you can see. Some, I've seen several of those. The uh, it's printed on the dial. Like, see how the numbers aren't shiny? They're not shiny gold. Yeah. So this is uh, all of the stuff on here. And if you look at it the right way in the light, you can kind of see the the paper, um, and the actual final version of the sorry, the actual final version of the clock wasn't like that. It was like metal, and it had a. Uh, it had uh, like engraving sort of in it, um, but yeah.
But yeah, back here we're gonna find a cuckoo clock for you guys. I got cuckoo clock. Let's see. Um, can I do a mechanical one? Yeah, yeah. Here, how about that one? Somebody wants the chicken clock again. Oh, no. <laughs> That's his favorite. He loves the chicken clock. He loves the chicken clock so much he actually bought two of them. Go get, go get the cock shoe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> there it is. There it is. Oh. Wow. Oh boy. That's the best one. I agree that is the best one. Oh, thank you for the paper crane, Armin. I think I want your job. <laughs> yeah, sadly this isn't my job. <laughs> I'm I'm only here for 2 weeks. I'm leaving here uh Tuesday morning, so I'm pretty sad. So fun to watch. Congrats on the successful chiming event. Thank you, Armin. I appreciate that. It was very successful. It, I almost cried whenever it went off at 12 because I just put so much time ha, into this. See what I did there? <laughs> uh, what are the other ones next to the chicken? What do they do? Oh, I'm glad you asked. We can go through here and get some. Let's see. This store is in Douglasville, Georgia. It's Champ's Clock Shop, about a half hour from uh, Atlanta. That's one of the best ones. That's almost as good as the chicken. I <laughs> That's the Elvis skunk. Hunk a skunk. Are they a band? <laughs> what was the ooh noise? I think it was like supposed to be the crowd in the background or something. They're not a band, but they could be. I think they could start their own little thing. This is the long shot horse. <laughs> the uh, piggy bank. Oh. Broke. Oh, I was showing that. Dad, I can make it. <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's fans would eat these up. <laughs> That's probably true. Um, and then the cactus. Hey, hey, don't wake up. Please, banana, banana. Hey, hey, don't wake up. Please, banana, banana. That was one of my first rhythm clocks, actually. I think it was like one of the first five. <laughs> but yeah, um, what does this one sound like? that one. Good question. Find out. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, it's off. Nice, nice catch there. <laughs> I was so confused. Is it not? Huh. That's odd. It's not working at all. Yeah, try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Nope. I have to ask that Jeff. Yeah, yeah, that one should play the same, but it's not running right now, so. I don't know. You'll have to ask Jeff about that. Thank you, So Fun. Thank you for coming in, Susan. What is that one? That one. I don't even know, honestly. It's kind of neat, though. Like, I like the, the hands on it and the dial. Um, yeah. Let's see. What else can we do? Let's see where Jeff's at. Let's go find Jeff. I think he's taking a long enough break, don't you think? Yeah. You should show him the clock tower mechanism. Yeah, he'd be able to demo it better than I do. We are about to have some chimes here in a couple minutes. Still taking a break. Still taking a break. Jeez, look at this. I'm over here sweating, getting all this work in. You guys are just out here eating cookies. That's right. Cookie monster. Where is this store? This is Champ's Clock Shop in Douglasville, Georgia, about a half hour from Atlanta. Uh, and today was our chiming event. Uh, Why? Well, I, I, I want to do the chimes because it's about to be the hour. I'll come back out after that, though. You're going to have to remind me, Chris, to come back out and do that. Cheapest Kit Kat is the plain black, and that is $59.99. And that's the same price they are online because Kit Kat has, you have to sell your clocks at a fixed rate. Uh, it's sort of similar to rhythm, but they're a little more flexible. Yeah. Well, wait, let's let's do that after uh, the chimes. Oh, it's, oh, that's down here. <laughs> let's do that after the chimes because everything's about to go off in about a minute or two. Oh, yeah, that was about three minutes. Yeah. Oh yeah, go ahead. You do, you do whatever you want. Yeah. Yeah. So we're all they're about to all go off here in a minute. <laughs> you guys getting ready? <laughs> no, they they don't do anything. Yeah, they just that that's all they do. Yeah. These will sort of. There's some back there that'll start to sort of go off, and then these right here, this wall, and that's whenever you know it's like starting. So, yeah. um, you are welcome, lobster. I, I recommend a Kit Kat clock. I got my mom one. We have it hanging in our kitchen, and she loved it so much she had to get another one. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's see here. Two minutes. Heard that. He's up there on guard watching. They're starting down here. Orange kick. How about the, the bangle kitty right here? <laughs> you can sort of hear it outside. It's time.
much quieter in here. <laughs> Most of the ones in here already went off. <laughs> My, I remember as a child, my mother had a black cat clock, just like the one at the beginning. Yeah, they, they're pretty popular. They have been since, uh, I mean, like, I think like the 50s or something. I could be wrong. It might even be earlier than that. Um, but yeah. Uh, can you order online? Um, you can email, call, send a message on Facebook. <laughs> um, but yeah. For sure, just uh, send them an email. And if you're looking for any rhythm clocks, I also have a website that is timelessclocks.co. Um, I have brand new rhythm clocks for sale on there. Champs has a much bigger selection than mine. So if you're looking for a rhythm clock in particular, um, Champs is the place to go for sure. Um, but if there's any models you're looking for, send them an email, call them. Uh, send them a message on Facebook. Uh, Champs is the place to be for sure. Um, I honestly, my own collection, if any of you in here are familiar with my own collection, I've got about 300 rhythm clocks. Um, about a third of my collection has come from this shop. <laughs> and that is no joke. I have spent way too much money in this, these four walls plus, you know, uh, but yeah, it's a it's an amazing place for sure. If you're ever in the Douglasville uh, area, uh, Douglas County, Atlanta, it's only a half hour from Atlanta. Um, it's the place to be, and I'm telling you. Can you please spell the store name? Yes, I will reply to your comment so you can see. Champs Clock Shop. There you go. Look them up on uh, Facebook. They got a website, champsclock.com, everything. Um, yes. Going upstairs now? Or. Oh, to see the inside, yeah. It's a little dark, but yeah, yeah, you can see for sure. It's the inside of a giant mantle clock. I'm gonna do it for you. No, I was just kind of trying to demonstrate. There you go, yeah. Yeah. Now, uh, we're going to find Jeff because somebody in here wants to hear the big bell. <laughs> and I would also like to hear the big bell. Do you, did you get to hear the big bell? Yes, I did. You did, yeah. I also got to hear it last time I was here, too. Let's go find Jeff here. Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. Jeff. And then we can go upstairs. The guts, I know, right? I know, right? <laughs> Andy, are they still outside? Are they still outside? All of them. Oh. Hey. I'm in the shop now. You want to do the honors of ringing the big bell for us? Oh, sure. I was going to ask your dad, but you're the one that's here, so. Yeah. Let me look and see. This is the sun. We love the chicken around here. If you don't like the chicken, what are they? What 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 can they do if they don't like the chicken, Nick? <laughs> Hope they remake another model. <laughs> Why is that one Bugle still pup open? Yeah. Or Saxy Wolf? Unpopular Why is that opinion. Open? Uh, it doesn't work. They've just put it on yeah, display. That was used in a, a movie we did recently. That's coming out this year, I believe. But uh, that was just. It doesn't work, so we just kept it in the open position for display. All right. Get ready. Close your ears, guys. All right, y'all. Tell how loud y'all want it. Loud. loud. <laughs> Give it to me. Give it to me. <laughs> there it is. Feel the vibration? I feel my heels flat wide. 
Yeah, yeah right. right. As hard as you could do it, uh, you do it at full if power. You, if you do it at full power, we just power. don't want to break this beveled glass over here, right? Yeah. <laughs> It'll be so loud that every single block in here, the glass will break. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did it scare you? That was time to see the <laughs> And he's used to it. <laughs> yeah, we're going to go upstairs real quick. Yeah. That that was the bell for everyone who First wanted the bell. We, we had quite a few uh, people wanting the bell. Thank you, handyman, for the heart puff. I appreciate that. It's nice and lit up here now, today, uh, this time of day. Oops. Does anybody want to hear a kitchen clock? Uh, perhaps. Okay. Oh my gosh, I finally made it to your TikTok live. What about this one? Does anyone hear this one? Uh, sure. I'm just finding excuses to make these things shine. <laughs> I don't. Just be careful with them, cause uh, you're you're technically not supposed to touch them. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I just, uh, cause the these up here especially are uh, all of Jeff's yeah, uh, collection, uh, and I don't. We don't want any of them to uh, break or anything to happen to any of them. Thank you for coming in, Adrian. Uh, sorry for. Yeah, I took a second there to respond to your comment. I'm, I'm very scatterbrained today. Very nice clocks. I'm from the Netherlands. Welcome. We are here in the United States in Douglasville, Georgia. So if you ever fly into the Atlanta airport, you got to make a little Uber trip here for sure. This is new. Yeah, yeah. I actually, I got to wind this earlier. Were I you? Helped. Did you, Were you up here? Yeah, he helped. Uh, I helped wind it. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty neat, for sure. Um, what is this, exactly? I just got jump scared. My name is also Adrian. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, yeah, back away. What? I have two questions. Yes, yeah. First off, what is that? Kind what of is it? This? Yeah, what brand? You'd have to ask Jeff. Honestly, let's see if there's any indication on there. Is there any inside the clock? Like mm, the there, there could be. I just don't want to mess with it, just in case. Uh, I'd rather him. I, <laughs> I'm very hesitant. That yeah, one. Where were these supposed to be? These were in um, train stations. Ah, cool. Yeah, and that's oh, actually and from. That uh, more fancy alarm clocks. Yeah, yeah. We, we got like a lot of the gang up here for sure. Uh, we even got the uh, sumo wrestler. There are many. Do I tell you what my dream is if I own this clock shop? What would that be? Make a video on me making every single clock chime. Like, <laughs> like this is me. <laughs> I'm just making every single one chime. That would be a long video for sure. <laughs> I wouldn't care. <laughs> uh, Lobster, thank you for your Lobster. comment and your previous comment as well. Uh, I forgot Lobster? to respond to that. I'm very scatterbrained today. Um, but yeah. I'm going to head downstairs. I'm going to go outside because uh, I'm probably going to end this stream here. But thank you for coming in, Lobster, to both streams. Um, I'm glad that you have enjoyed. Um, maybe next year you can make it. That would be really fun if you could uh, get to come down here and see um, for yourself in person. Um, but thank all you guys for coming in today. It's been really, really awesome. Um, and I'm so just beyond grateful to be able to get to hang out with all of you on here. Uh, for one, at home. Uh, but for two, this is just, I mean, amazing from here, from this clock shop. Hopefully there will be a lot more uh, live streams and stuff in the future uh, from the shop. But yeah, it's uh, definitely worth the trip if you guys can make it. Uh, it's an amazing place it's i mean it's it's literally in the middle of nowhere here um but it's it's definitely worth the trek out to douglas county if you can make it um what would happen if one of these things came down in that direction <laughs> well we would hope that wouldn't happen for sure but uh <laughs> but yeah um 
so yeah but anyway um thank you all for coming in today it's been really fun thank you to my friends drake and chris over there for joining me today and my mom for holding the camera as well as uh jeff and nick for making their little appearances every Balance. once in a while Balance. um i'm doing it i'm doing it oh no wait do it again do it again no, <laughs> he's doing it. He's doing it. <laughs> there have been a lot of people here visiting today uh, from all over. Um, but yeah, it's been it's been quite a day. Uh, Drake and I, I think we're probably the farthest, farth farthest, farthest. <laughs> Drake and I were probably the farthest because we're both from Ohio. Uh, I'm from North Carolina. He's from North Carolina, so uh, we made the trek out today, and it was uh, it was worth it, I'd say. Um, but yeah, we we would love to see y'all next year uh, if you want to start making plans, man. Trust me, it's worth it. Uh, March eighth of twenty twenty five. So come on down to see us. We would love to see y'all if you can make it. And, uh, yeah, so, bye-bye, Juicy Kirby Legs, bye-bye, uh, Lobster, and all y'all that are in here, I gotta leave you off with one final thing. Yeah. Hey, baby, wake up. Come and dance with me. Wow. Yeah. Hey, baby, wake up.